Welcome back, everybody. Meteorologist Joe Ranieri is here, and Joe, we're heading into October. We are, and honestly, I know people think, "Oh, great! I got to pull off the, uh, you know, all the lawn chairs and the yeah. back, you know, the patio." No, eh, you maybe can, not. You can hold off here another, <laughs> at least another week. There is right. some rain in the forecast, but under a tenth of an inch. We're going to be looking at some great conditions. And speaking of great conditions, let's go out to the Oregon coast over in Cannon Beach. This is the final sunset of September. This was just a few hours ago. Beautiful conditions out there for beginning to. <laughs> end and we're going to see more of that same heading into your Sunday. Right now we're looking at a temperature of 58 degrees, clear skies, and we're going to be looking at clear skies heading into tomorrow morning. I, I do expect to see a little bit of some fog to do, develop uh, along the central part of the Willamette Valley near Salem South, Corvallis, Eugene. You're kind of included under that umbrella. We're going to be looking at overnight lows right around the low to mid 40s. Nothing's going to be popping up on the radar until Monday morning. We'll be seeing a, a system move on shore very light and weak. That's going to kind of come through here, bringing in some scattered showers at times and then looking into Tuesday, a few more showers. But again, for the most part, we're looking at uh, some really pleasant conditions heading into the first week of October. Here's a look at the future cast. I have this queued up here tomorrow night. That's when we start to see those clouds increase. Now during the daytime, we'll be seeing nothing but sunshine. So it's going to be a very pleasant day ahead as you get ready to wrap up your weekend. And here we are right around 839 o'clock. We'll start to see some light showers. Of course, Astoria along the northern part of the Oregon coast into the southwest Washington coast, you'll be seeing some some heavier amounts and that's kind of where most of that rainfall will be. But again, I say most of that rainfall, you'll be looking at it maybe just over a tenth of an inch over in Astoria. Meanwhile, here in the metro area, the northern part of the metro area, you're going to be looking at under a tenth of an inch, five one hundredths of an inch throughout over Kelso, Portland and uh, throughout parts of the uh, Salem area. You're going to be seeing just a little more than trace amounts. Temperatures right now are running right around the upper 50s uh, throughout the Portland area. 55 in Woodland, you get a little farther away from the city. You're seeing temperatures in the low 50s on your Saturday night. Highs today, we topped out in the upper 60s, almost 70 degrees in many locations. Scapoo 70 we will go above it heading into Sunday afternoon along the Oregon coast for uh, late September. You saw temperatures in the mid 60s. So October starts sunny and nice for tomorrow, and it's going to be a few showers for Monday and Tuesday. But again, like I just said, a very light amounts. And as we go throughout the later part of the week, we'll gradually see our temperatures warm up a little bit. Now throughout the valley, it's going to be a crisp morning. Look at these overnight lows right around the low 40s. Yeah, it will be feeling like fall for sure. And throughout the Columbia River Gorge, overnight lows will be dropping down into the low to mid 40s. Daytime highs on your Sunday afternoon will be in the low 70s. And throughout central and eastern Oregon, daytime temperatures topping out in the mid to the upper 60s. So a little bit cooler over there. And over in the Oregon Cascades, take a look at Timberland Lodge. Overnight low of 29 degrees. And now as we look at tomorrow's day planner, again, starting off crisp and cool for the Portland Marathon by 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock temperatures in the mid 40s. By 10 a.m. though, 55 degrees, still clear and cool. By midday, 65 degrees on our way to a high of 72 degrees. So expect to see that cool morning, followed by sunny skies by the afternoon. Some light showers for Monday and into Tuesday. I think we were more dry than wet for Tuesday. And then look at Tuesday and beyond. We see temperatures close to 80 degrees by Friday. Warming back up. Yeah. Something else, but crisp tomorrow for the runners. That's great, right? And then you know it's going to kind of a, a refreshing way to uh, start the morning. <laughs> I say that as I'll be in bed while all the thousands of people are running <laughs> around the streets of downtown. Portland. We're pulling for them. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Joe. Orlando.